Now, we're all excited for this Black Ops 6 Zombies release, but I've seen this drop and I'm thoroughly confused as to what is this, bro. If I can, if I can sit here and, 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 and concoct how my player is built like I'm playing 2K on my zombies, I don't know if I'm leaning towards I'm excited or if I'm leaning towards why. I, 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 I'm not going to be one of them fanboys who be like, I want it to be exactly how it was when I was a little kid, and I don't want any innovation or change. I'm excited for change, and I'm excited for a different if it's done correctly. If it's not done correctly and, and thought out thoroughly and well designed, I'm going to be pissed because I'm going to be feeling like I'm wasting my time. But this is dope, though. If you if, if Let's just say it's going to be perfect when it come out. The way you can customize how your build is and how you fight the zombies. I think this is a 10 out of 10 thing if it's well did. Because ain't no way I can build a, a Hall of Fame stretch big zombies killer. They'll be insane. I ain't gonna lie. I normally play solo. But if I have a team, I'm making the best healer in the world. Because I know I'm not going down. But I'm... I'm, I'm I know I'm gonna be running with some bombs, and I'm gonna have to one tap them to get them back up to make us get to the end of the, of the uh, mission. Cause I know it's like an X fill again. I know they're gonna do that again. I'm not really upset about the X fill. I think that's all right or whatnot. The straight round base is cool too, but I think I'm 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 gonna be in, I'm gonna be in, I'm gonna be on the the Easter egg side this round, you know, to give the game more longevity for myself. But you can like research and and and, and build. Witch potions. I think that's dope. I can't hate on it. I just think if they do it right, it can be something great. If they do it wrong, I'ma just wanna, you know what I'm saying? Gonna call it a day on this bad boy. But look, juggernaut. I don't even know what it is. Perk perk colas. You know that's that's the normal for us. We we know what all these are. We know the jug. We know stamina. We know all that. Boom boom boom. PH frost back. That's dope. Like. Retaliation, probiotic, hardened plates, turtle shell, durable plates. That's correct. Let me read them, bro. Deal bonus damage while health is low. I don't like retaliation because my health's never going to get low. So I'm going to X this one out automatically. We're never using this one. Me personally. If you're, a, if you're one of those that get hit a lot, this may be your thing. But I never get touched on zombies. Slightly increased maximum health with juggernaut. Mm. I feel like this right here really for them. Yeah, them ones for real. If you if you one of them ones. But then again, I don't even know. Like, I don't know if it's like an upgrade system to your perk or you can unlock all of them at the same time. Or is it you choose what you want? But I'm looking at the, the scale. It looks like you can it, it just goes together all one. But from the chart we see, it looks like, I don't know if on this chart, this is your dude. Like, you click it, this is the map. I'm thinking it is what it do. See, now I'm confused because you got the jug right here, but then you got the you got the, the witch potion right here. Then you got, hmm. See, this is difficult. The thing is with zombies... They never really give or explain anything. You gotta just go in the game and struggle, which I understand. It's a big mystery survival game. I don't want to give out too much either. But with things like this, leaks like this, it's just insane to me. Like I just need to understand, creator man. Okay, we get that. I want to know if I can either if I upgrade it, do all of this go into it at one time. If so. I don't need, I can see us going to around a thousand nowadays if you got the time. Cause that's insane, like to just juice yourself up this much. I have to I have to give that a ten out of ten thing to do. Like the, the details and designs, let's check these out. Go to design. Beautiful be the the designs for these are, are dope. I can't I can't hate bro. Okay. But this the thing. I'm not a reader. I have to watch somebody explain what I'm watching, uh, what I'm reading. Your back department? Uh, yeah, I'd like to file a claim. Ladies and gentlemen, Trey. Now, the thing is with zombies, people, they're the number one complainers. So let me just go to the, the, the OG, understand what he's saying. Zombies people, they complain. Call of Duty people complain. 
about everything. Call of Duty can make a perfect game. The COD community going to find something to complain about. So I really don't really too much take it to heart what they say in the comments about COD. Because I think COD got like a low rating right now and no one's even played the game. So how is that even possible? Let's see what Mr. Rock Rock will say. Augments in Black Ops 6 Zombies. Those are special upgrades that you can use to upgrade your perks, field upgrades, and ammo mods into totally different versions of their base functionalities. In this video, we're going to go through this blog post, which has a whole load of info on all of the augments in the game. It's got info on specific perks. We're also going to be taking a look at... Bro, what did he find? Is I tried to go here, but I couldn't find it. I need to do I need to I need to do better research on the PC man. I don't know how to I don't so know how you did the it. Tacticals in the game, the gobble gums in the game. But that's why we watching this because I have no idea. What he, as well, there's the launch gobble gums in here too. So there's a No gobble gums is crazy. I seen that you might have to but you can buy gobble gums. Huge amount of info on the way, so buckle up, subscribe to the channel if you're new and we will get started. So Augments are unlockable gameplay advantages you can apply to every Perka Cola ammo mod and field upgrade in the game. There are 108 Augments at launch, and that is 6 for each perk, 6 for each ammo mod, and 6 for each field upgrade. Which is, I think, a decent number to start with, and those are... Yeah, that's, that's great to start with, but I'm still trying to figure out what is an argument broken down into three majors and three minors now there are a bunch of images that they've got in here like i showed you a few a second ago there's the one for juggernog we're going to address those in a second but first we just need to ingest some of the information about how we get these things so let's start with researching and choosing augments to unlock the full potential of your loadouts you've got to research augments mm -hmm. this unlocks at player level 11 so i guess we're gonna have to grind out a couple of matches first right grinding out a couple of matches um i plan on hitting uh level 11 my first game i don't even plan on dying so as soon as the game start i'm gonna be playing for 24 hours straight i'm not gonna go down i'm not even gonna pee i'm gonna just strictly grind it out so i can unlock everything and, and give you guys the best just so y'all can witness how great i am at zombies i never i never displayed my talents on zombies ever y'all never seen me play zombies i play it in my free time is where i meditate i never rage the only game i've never raged in now on 2K, never mind, let's get back to the video. First, before we can get progress on this, you then research and unlock individual augments, and they can be chosen before the start of the match for each individual perk, ammo, and field upgrade, and to start... The thing is with this new zombies, I can see it's going to be a lot of preparation, bro. A lot of reading, a lot of studying. And that's one thing I haven't been loving in the new game, and uh, the new side of gaming, because every game now, for some reason, it makes it to where I can't just enjoy the game casually. Every game is super sweaty. And by the looks of it, this is falling into the same lines with the sweatiness and studying the game. Like, I don't want to study a game to play and enjoy the game, bro. I want to just turn on the game and play. Now I got to find out what's the best build on my zombies. I can't just start the zombies match and get my shotgun and go forever. I can't do that no more. Now I gotta study the the, the, the movement mechanics. What what thing open the door the best? What door best quotes with this gun? Which match go with this? I don't wanna do all that, bro. I just wanna shoot a zombie and chill. Now I'm about to get frustrated for my first year frustrated with zombies, cause I gotta study zombies. I already gotta study life. Now I gotta study zombies, bro. Start the video, Raffle Raffle. Doing that research, you just select which item you'd like to research in the menu and then start earning XP in game. Right. And that will progress you towards unlocking the augment. Right. So presumably that means that on this screen, you go to research augments and you just choose the one that you want to work on next. And I confirmed with the Treyarch team when I spoke to them personally a few months ago that when you... See, the thing is with Mr. Raffle Raffle, I believe him. First of all, his hair not even brushed. And second of all... What is the things in his background? Like, he's so geeked out. He has a teddy bear beside a Kermit the Frog inside of a Dark Vader cloak. Beside a dollar bill inside of a case. Beside his OG YouTube 1 million play. Uh, it's like his information just never fails. I've been watching cuz since I was a kid, teaching me how to play zombies. I don't even know how he be knowing the stuff he be knowing for. You can't trust Waffle Waffle, but, but you can trust That's just them. basically repackaging systems that we already had in previous games. It's right. like saying, let's take away a feature, and then mm. we'll say that it's a new feature when we give it back to you. What feature is that? What feature? What, what feature he say? 
said this here makes me worry a little bit that if you already have an idea of which augments you should look for, that means that the things that augments do are already familiar. They're going to be like, revive a teammate a bit faster or like get a speed boost after you've revived a teammate. But that's just basically repackaging systems mm, that we've already had in previous games. So it's okay. like saying, let's take away a feature okay. and then Okay, we'll so to get the arguments, you're going to have to do like a little side quest and whatnot. It's okay. Say that it's a new feature okay. when we give it back to you. That's okay. normally how this should work, I feel like. So if that's what I'm correctly kind of sussing mm -hmm. out from what I'm reading here, I'm not so much of a fan of it. Just a, a subjective little comment about the way okay. that they're rolling this out. So let's assess whether or not that's the case with right. Jug and then also with the energy mine here as well, just as sort of two test cases. So it's got this initial area here. It says unlock six total augments to begin this research. Mm. So you actually need to start elsewhere. So there Oh, okay. Now I'm getting a little bit more more educated on this the arguments is 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 which one you pick so if i pick jug if i want to work on strictly jug i gotta grind and do the missions to get the jug arguments to unlock the the the, the, the perks under the arc okay 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 there is a kind of progression tree through other we can skip this when i'm too educated to be on this too long i get what they're doing now what's stamina up i'm a fan of stamina okay. and like I, I, I like stamina as a, as a perk, bro. Very, I think, mm, see, that's a tough one. I gotta, I think speed cola, I gotta have a speed cola, and I gotta have stamina, and I gotta have... Like, no one really cares go. about the ADS precision nearly as much as they care about the increased critical damage. But let's see, maybe I'll be maybe I'll be mistaken if some of these other ones are really good. Deal double critical damage if an enemy is at full health. Ooh. Mm. So if you're using a sniper build, this could be OP. Mm. So long as. And we know how I used to get down with them. Well, y'all don't know, but I used to get down with those snipers on the zombies though, cast. And we talking about double damage when the, the bad boy at full health. Bruh, <laughs> one shot, everything going down, bro. That's going to be some nasty. That's going to be some nasty. Your shot is killing them because otherwise you're then going to do less damage and you'd maybe just want the increased damage on every shot. So, okay, I can, I can, I, I can see what they're doing there. That's good. I'm, I like that. It's quite simply an extra life. But then again, with all this included, it just brings me to food. This is going to be one of the hardest zombies ever, bro. Like the with the beta they were playing when they was at the convention, the zombies jump when they was they was getting it early, playing it early, bro. I, they had to have that jump on easy mode for sure, of course. But bro, this jump finna be so sweaty, fool. I ain't got a game. I ain't played a game where I can my even Mario sweaty, bro. I ain't played a game where I can just chill in so long, bro. And here I am about to play another mind of a game. I really don't think game is my hobby, bro. It gotta be something else I'm interested in, cause it can't be this, cause it doesn't, it doesn't make me and cheese. You just keep rebuying quick revive, cause there's no, there's no limit like there is here. So yeah, I mean, everyone's gonna be using that. Reviving an ally increases what using what removed on use. What? What are you saying? Interesting. I mean, this is just an extra life. So I, I feel like everybody is gonna use this one, cause that's OP. That is strong as hell. Dying wish, bro. Dying wish is on Black Ops uh, Four, right? Yeah, Dying Wish, they, I think they liked their little perk. They had that on the uh, on their 9 map. I'm pretty sure it was on all the maps, but I really only played that bad boy. But I had the other maps, but I don't remember playing them for real. But Dying Wish was already on there. It's a cool joint. I don't die, so this is the thing. I don't need a second life. See, you need this second life. I'd rather use something helpful. This is a waste of space. If I go down, I deserve to just go and get to the menu. I don't deserve a second chance. If you need a second chance at life... It is quite simply an extra life. And you can just keep rebuying. Skip, because only bombs will use that one. Also trigger random ammo mods. That's kind of cool. And slightly reduce all ammo mod cooldowns. I think that's probably the biggest Bro, deal there. Next he really went down each game. one. I was trying to get... Aura, which heals all nearby There's no way Waffle Waffle just sat here and went through everyone. I'm not going to sit here and watch him go through everyone, bro. Y'all can go just go to the go, go to the menu. Where, where he even get this at? Did you put it in... Did you put it... You didn't put it in the You didn't put it in the description. Let's see if we can find it before we exit off the uh cod. 
is we go to call, call of duty black ops 6 how did he get there that's what i'm trying to figure out i don't know how he got there i would assume here no it wasn't here see bro they know too much bro i don't know how they do it bro do you click this can you click this overall do you scroll down and see am i doing it right am i doing it right i don't think i'm yes sir i found this so make sure you go to the website call the website and they break each one down to you bro we found it designs are dope i like this this is gonna be crazy bro i'm, I'm so i've been waiting on this for so long bro next week bro, i'm locking myself in like a, a mental state of just just zombies that's it so if you're not trash and you want to run with me, you just just drop your name. I'm not gonna play with you. I just want you to just comment this all because I already got my squad, me myself and I. But if you want to go crazy and enjoy yourself in this game, knock yourself off. Compare your stats to mine. By the end of next week, we'll see who really the goat. Drop your stats in the comment too. I'll see y'all the week after. I'm gonna probably I'm gonna for sure live stream my whole rundown on me downloading it, me playing it and everything. So y'all will be watching me firsthand go crazy. This is crazy just to see all of this, bro. Okay, so they got these back. Okay, I like that. I got see what's their dark flare? What's dark flare? Honestly, ah, uh, he's gonna explain it right here. Let me see what dark. Let me let's read what dark flare is real quick because I like that. I, I like that name. Dark flare significantly increases dark flare duration. Wait, about to explain what it do. Dark flare generates an energy band that deals lethal shadow damage. And okay, it's just one of them. just destroy everything. So, but I appreciate y'all for even watching me talk about zombies. How excited I am! I know you can tell by the tone of my voice how excited I am. I'll just see y'all later playing zombies.